today's subscription spot, we are having a look at the Hero Box monthly mystery box from SuperheroStuff.com. If you'd like to have one of these bad boys delivered to your house every single month, you can click the link down below. The world's largest superhero store, www.SuperheroStuff.com. Warning though, this package contains extremely awesome materials, open with pure excitement. And I'm sure Spot certainly will be doing that. Without further ado, let's get ourselves our knife and we're going to get this cut open, find out what we got inside from Hero Box. There we go, we're going to cut the tape on either side. Spot does certainly love enjoying, Spot certainly loves enjoying, Spot enjoys opening up monthly mystery subscription boxes. It always gives me a chance to see what interesting goodies. It's like Christmas every day. Well, at least once a month. First things first, we got ourselves an exchange form. Probably won't be exchanging anything anytime soon. Got ourselves some bubble wrap. I'm gonna put that to the side. I can already see something that's Batman related. And we got ourselves a glass. Batman Toon Tumblers, www.toontumblers.com. I got myself Batman. I don't know how it's possible, but they might have also known that Batman's probably one of my favorite superheroes. Yeah, actually, he is my second favorite superhero right behind Superman. I will be making use of this. That would also explain why there was so much bubble wrap inside. This is obviously glass. So we got ourselves a little tumbler of Batman. And I think that's all what the bubble wrap was for. I don't think, I think everything else, I think everything else is A-OK. -okay. okay, so, looks like, of course. Oh, and also, also, also. The one thing also I wanted to mention about the hero boxes is, <laughs> of course, themed with Batman, is the fact that you can actually specify your theme character. So when you subscribe to the super, you know, to the hero box, um, you can't, you know, you can't specify which characters you want. So Batman, Superman, Spider-Man, any, any which, which again would explain why everything in here is so Batman heavy. We got ourselves an auto tag frame or for, of course, your license plate. Don't laugh, I might actually even put this around my car. I will be the guy driving around in my little car with the Batman license plate frame. There's on the back. This comes to us from Chroma. www.chroma-graphics.com I got myself a Batman license plate frame. We of course also have ourselves a t-shirt. You would have to get yourself a t-shirt in there as well. Ah, rip the plastic. Apparently, this plastic was made in Krypton. I asked for Batman stuff. I ultimately got a bag from Krypton. And we got ourselves Batman Gotham City Dark Knight. This is also a DC Comics original t shirts It's an actual legitimate DC Comics t-shirt. Very nice. We'll put that also to the side. And... There's more Batman. Even still, I got myself Batman suspenders. That's what it looks like right there. So imagine, if you will, Spot driving down the street with his little car. I have to keep prefacing it with little car. I got, of course, the Batman license plate frame. Auto tag frame. I'll also be the guy drinking very carefully. Don't be distracted while you're driving, but I'll be drinking from my Batman uh, tumbler. And also, I'll be wearing Batman suspenders. Oh, and also wearing my Batman t-shirt. I'll be very, very easy to pick out. Next, we also have ourselves um, a pin. Let's hold the pin up here so you guys can actually see it. It says, I'm a Batman crime fighter. I'm a Batman crime fighter. My thumb was actually covering the bottom. <laughs> my thumb was covering the bottom of it. It says, I'm a Batman crime fighter. Featuring... A Golden Age, perhaps Silver Age, Batman and Robin. I can always make use of pins. I love pins. Also got myself a magnet. No, is it a magnet? No, actually. It is a bottle opener. Fancy that. Look at that. It's a little bottle opener. That's the noise that I would make. I wouldn't make it. That's the sound the bottle would make. 
when I'd be op opening it with my Batman bottle opener. Moving along, we also got ourselves, speaking of magnets, I got myself a Batman magnet. Open, 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 open. Dump and enjoy. The crime fighter is depicted here. It's actually a rubber material, but on the back it's a magnet. Batman soft touch PVC magnet. DC Comics. I like I like how it's three dimensional. Can you see that? And it's also rubber. I like that. This will be going up onto my fridge. Yes, the ever crowded, ever filling up fridge of magnets. What else do we have in here? Batman Classic TV Series playing cards. They have Joker as the Eight of Hearts. Would have been more ironic if they had actually had him as the Joker, but I guess that's not a card you would be playing in most cases. Play along with this deck of playing cards featuring 52 unique images from the Batman Classic TV Series. Sorry, what? Yes. Yes, of course I can open it. This just changed one person's opinion. He was just about, just about to hit the dislike button. He says, uh, Spot doesn't open those trading cards. Guaranteed, that's a dislike. Oh, he did open it. Okay. This time, this time, Spot, you've saved yourself. Next time, maybe not so much. There's the Joker, which actually is the Joker. Okay, so on the back, though, it's... Well, it's one of the Jokers. It's basically Joker getting his lights, his lights punched out, though he is more laughing than anything else. So, of course, Joker, Cesar Romero, Joker, fittingly enough, as the Joker. Batman is the Ace of Spades. I'm not going to go through all of these. Oh, Julie Newmar. Meow. Jo uh, Bat uh, Robin, Dick, and Bruce. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry, whenever Spot talks about Batman the anim oh, Batman the Classic series, I always seem to sneeze. I must be allergic to great, fun, and campy older series. There's the Riddler. One of the three, I think there was three Mr. Freeze. I don't think he was the one. Was he the one, the episode where Mr. where Batman has to sit with Mr. Freeze, and Mr. Freeze has all these tiles in his room that go from red if they're really hot to blue if they're cold, and Robin and Batman have to hold on, stay warm, as Mr. Freeze changes the tiles. It potentially could have been. No, I don't think it was. I don't think it was this one. And he served him baked Alaska. Bookworm. Remember Bookworm? No? Okay. What else we got in here? Oh, Julie Newmar. I won't do that with the Mad Hatter. I wonder if false faces in uh, Egghead. Exactly, Batman. Batman and Robin. I'm sure that's them. It does look, especially Burt Ward. Wow, God, he looks like he's 40. <laughs> Julie Newmar. Some spikes. More Julie Newmar. More Mr. Freeze. Burgess, Burgess Meredith as the Penguin. Coffee. Meow. The one thing I would have liked... Shane! Come back, Shane. Come back. One thing I would have liked is to see... Oh, there's King Tut. What I was saying is I wish I could. we would have seen some more uh, villains in there. Like Siren. Remember Siren? Joan Collins. What else was there? There's Queen of the Cossacks. I can't remember what her name was. Black Widow. Not that Black Widow. Just some older woman. Played actually by the girl that was in Adam's Family. She played Morticia. I believe her name was Black Widow. Moving that aside, what else do we have? We've got a card and a comic and another pin. I feel like I'm in... There we go. I feel like I was in Narnia for example. I was just like reaching my hand in and there was... I just continued to pull stuff out. We got I Hate Joker, or I Hate the Joker. 
We got the Hero Box, which I'll go through these separately at the end. SuperheroStuff.com, 15% off, orders over $40. Use this coupon code, you're very welcome. That's for you. And, uh, oh, look at this. This is Robin to the Joker's Wild. Now, I, I mentioned that. You can clearly see what it is, but I mentioned that because I think I have, I have all of the first Robin series. I have most of Robin 2, but I don't know if I actually have this one. Funny enough. See how the universe just hands you things? Oh, I'm going to so totally have to owe the universe after all this. We have ourselves a card. The card breaks down everything that we got inside this hero box. Uh, you have a t-shirt. Of course, you knew you were getting a Batman uh, bat shirt, right? Yes, of course. It's got some bat suspenders. Drink wear. License plate frame. We've got some buttons, magnets, bottle opener, a cards, cards, and comic book and coupon. Collect a piece of comic book history with this hand selected comic. Retail value, by the way, of that is priceless. It's priceless. If you guys would like to have all of this delivered to your house every single month, you can click the link down below and check out Superhero Stuff. A bit of a different box today because you can actually pick the character that you'd like to have your box from. And in this case, so I was of course having a look at Batman. You would not have guessed otherwise. But today, we were having a look at the hero box. Uh, certainly stay tuned guys, Spot's gonna have more subscription spots heading your way as we have a look at other items that come to your house every single month. Thanks for watching as you always do. I'll see you next time.